Hey y'all, how y'all doing? It's your girl Deb here. Hope y'all doing pretty good out there, me. I'm just peachy, peachy, peachy. This is what I got today. I got me some cornbread, string beans, and potatoes. Got that bacon and onions in there. Woo! I tell you what, y'all. This is well seasoned right here. When I say well seasoned, I got that garlic salt up in there. All right, y'all. Hope y'all doing pretty good out there and staying safe and blessed up. Let's get this in, guys. Heavenly Father, I ask that you bless this food. I'm about to put it in my body and nourish it in Jesus' name. Amen. All right. I need to taste my cornbread. I added some uh, sugar in there. I sure did. Let me put this right here. I need to try my cornbread out. I started to make some Jiffy Mix. Okay. It's sweet enough. Here you that. Mm-hmm. Since I love bacon so much, I decided that I do my bacon whole. Mm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, all kinds of bacon up in that bad boy. I got some onions up in there too. Mmm. I let these uh, potatoes and green beans, I let them cook for 45 minutes. Of course, I had to rinse the potatoes off first. You know, them potatoes can be very dirty. Mm-hmm. 
Ja, die tun dat nou. They was doing good when they first started out. And they try to fight each other. Don't sit your tail down. Mm. Well, I need up all the bacon. Mm-mm. Okay. Let me try to spread the love of the bacon. Should have did some bacon bits. But I'm good with that. <clears throat> That's it. The uh, potatoes and the uh, string greens, I added some chicken broth in that. Oh, 
I want to have milk. I'll tell you what, that was good. Hush your mouth. Well, I'll tell you what. <laughs> you got the, the two little dogs going against the big dog. Go sit down. Oh my God. Mm -mm. Okay, so. That was mm 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 good. Y'all, that was good. You got any food that you want me to cook? Let me know what it is. Let me see what I can do with it. I'm gonna probably have to put a little spin on it. Oh, that was good. Yeah, I've been watching. I don't know if you guys ever uh, heard of, um, probably have, Law, Law and Crimes. Oh my God, I was binge watching it. Literally binge watching uh, this case where this, uh, this guy, he was uh, going to the store and, excuse me, as he went into the store, you had two guys and two girls came in the store together. All four of them was together and this guy was going to get him something to eat. One of the girls pursued him and uh, I guess he walked away, got his stuff in the store, and then walked out to uh, to his uh, vehicle. She came out there to talk to him again, right? So, as he walking away, I guess she invited him to a party that they were having. Man, I sat there and I looked at that case and I sat there and I looked at that case and that guy ended up in court and I first thing came to my mind, I bet he never thought that he would be in court for committing a crime against someone who he didn't know. They pursued him and his uh, attorney tried to, uh, uh, I don't know what you call it when you try to get the jurors on his side basically saying that the girl pursued him and that's why she ended up getting killed but you know no nah, that doesn't justify it i mean you control your own mind you control your own mind he ended up in uh court he got hit with a bunch of charges because what he did he actually thought 
that he killed all four of them. He killed the two girls. And the two guys, they survived in this case. They survived. I'm like, man. They survived and they ended up testifying against one, uh, one of them. I don't know what happened with that other one. But, um, yeah. I said, man, his life changed just like that. Not even thinking, you know. All because of what they were trying to do to him. He decided to take their life. I'm like, wow. You know, I tell you what, being at home, being quarantined, there's a lot of stuff I'm missing. <laughs> a lot of stuff that I'm missing. I'm so used to, I'm so used to working until once they gave me that photo, it's like, what are you going to do? I figured out what I can do, you know. It is what it is. You figure out what you can do and just move on, push on, you know. You can't you can't change what's going on with the world right now. The only thing you can do is stay positive and blessed. That's it. Positive, blessed with less stress. How about that? Oh, I ran right there, y'all. I was about to head out. I appreciate you guys for coming on my channel and watching my, uh, clicking on my video, watching my content. I do have in this video where it's showing where I'm cooking the food and everything. So, that is a bonus as well for you guys. I want to thank you guys. Appreciate it. As always, let, let someone that you know out there, how much you appreciate them. It goes a long way. Stay safe and y'all stay blessed up. Y'all take care and see you in the next video. I'm out.